Hello Twin Flames and welcome to the DM to DF message for Thursday. So in today's daily Twin Flame reading, I was going to use the Twin Flame journey messages, but the angels were really guiding me to use them now. And I'm also going to bring in the powerful DM confessions deck. So this is a beautiful Bridget Rowe deck. It really gets to the heart of what's going on within them. So today, what do they want to confess? So what does your masculine want to confess to you today? Straight out the deck there. What does your masculine want to confess to you today? Wow, okay, let's do this. So the energy is, if I knew then what I knew, what I know now, I would have made different choices. So he's letting you know, if he could go back in time, he would do things a lot differently. And you know that when you connect with his energy, because he's saying, you know, I know I've made mistakes, can we rub them out? Can we start again? If I knew then what I know now. So he's letting you know he's growing up, he's realising things, he's further ahead on his journey than you think. He's saying, lying was just easier for me than telling you the truth. So what does that mean? That means when he's lied about his feelings, denied the way he feels for you. It was easier than telling the truth because he knew that if he admitted the truth, it would open a can of worms. It would open a big can of worms, so he would have to change things. He may have not been yet ready to change. So this is also an idea for you of why he does the things he does. You know, it gives you an insight into his psyche and what he's going through and what he's understanding. So he's saying to you, if I could go back, I wouldn't lie. If I could go back in time, I would be honest. I would just tell you what I'm feeling because I feel it body, mind and soul. And he feels it. He feels it so strong, it takes him over. Your beauty still moves me, and it does. When he thinks of you, connects with you, it moves him. It moves him in so many ways. It moves his body. You know, I really feel that he's having ascension symptoms today. Heat, power, body reactions to you. You know, and it's this heat, this desire, this fire, it's coming over him at crazy times he may be at work and he gets turned on thinking of your beauty thinking of your body thinking of the way you are and the things you've said it moves him and it moves him towards you and your beauty and your light because it's not just about your outer appearance and the way you look and the clothes you wear and the way you do your hair and your makeup or the way you wear things it's about your insights the way your heart shines, the generosity of you, your kindness, your love, your empathy. That's what he's attracted to, the way you are inside and out. And I know you're right, but I need to come to my own conclusion. So he's showing you here, he has to do it his own way. He has to do it his own way because that's the right way for him. And when he comes to his own conclusions, does it in his own time, makes his own decisions, he won't let you down because he won't feel pressured or forced into anything. So he's showing that to you. And please don't take what happened personally. It's not you, it's me. It's not you, Divine Feminine. It's me. It was my fault. I know I made mistakes. I lied, held things back, didn't do things the right way. It was all me. And he's saying to you, thank you for loving me more than anyone ever has. I never knew anyone could love me like you. So he's thanking you for being you, for the love that you feel for him constantly and give to him constantly, even when he's letting you down or causing you pain. You know your truth. Thank you for loving me more than anyone ever has. And that scares him too, because no one's ever loved him the way that you do. And that drives him a bit crazy too. Your scent is addictive and I swear I can smell you when you're gone. He smells you. He's reminded of you through smells, scents. That may be your perfume, your aftershave. Could be the smell of flowers or something significant to your connection. But he is smelling you everywhere. And I get insecure when it comes to you. I'm nervous and overwhelmed in your presence. And that's how I'm feeling. And I'm getting this sense of urgency that he needs to tell you how he feels. He needs to come forward. He's afraid you're going to leave him. And there's that insecurity about what will happen if he doesn't get this done. I want to run my hands all over your soft skin and through your hair. So when he's allowing his mind to wander, he's visualizing, touching you, being intimate with you, showing you he cares. And I'm sorry if I've ever made you question your own worth. You are incredible inside and out. 
So he's saying, I'm sorry I let you down, messed you about, made you question my feelings for you and made you feel like you don't matter because you do. You are incredible inside and out. And that's absolutely what I'm feeling. The inside of you and the outside of you. Everything about you turns him on, drives him wild. And that's why you make him insecure because he's never loved like this before. He's never felt like this before. And that's what he's showing to you today. So trust in the love. He loves you inside and out. Have a great day and I'll see you soon.